Marius Titus. You are a general of Rome. I brought you here to protect me from Damocles. <laughs> but you are Damocles! <laughs> God's protect. You are Damocles! Indeed I am. And my story is almost at an end. I became driven by one thought, one solitary desire, the desire for vengeance. Vengeance against the Emperor Nero, who had my family butchered. Vengeance against his despicable sons who betrayed my legion! In order to exact my vengeance, I'd have to return to where my journey began. Return to my home. Danger surrounded me on my journey back to Rome. The evil which had plagued Britain had now infected this city. Starving refugees from our once free Rome lined the roads, telling tales of deprivation and torture. The rule of law lay shattered. My life's solitary purpose was to return to Rome and end the evil that you created, Nero. To prevent you from destroying the Rome that I love and to return it to its people. who hung my brother, I beg you! Take them all, drown them and their loved ones in the fire. Victorious! What's this then? Valiant hero, battle scarred veteran of the campaign. <laughs> Whoa! 
The legionary murdered Atticus and Janus. Someone's in there. You two, take a look. Nothing. Get back to your post. Yes, sir. I'm gonna have to stay off the streets if I want to avoid trouble. soldier on the kill and we're going to find him you murdering scum come on lads drop your weapons
Fifty... Nine! How many more? About a hundred or so. Up on Veer or Gusty. Someone drew Nero's face on a horse's ass. Not a good idea. Talk about collective punishment. We're burying the whole street. There's no clean water, no sanitation, no bedding, and food! What food? I have to beg for it! Are you lost, stranger? No. I'm home. Not like you remember it, though, eh? Nothing is in Rome now. You see, Marius, it's not always in distant lands that our greatest enemies lurk. Who are you? Why did this happen? My father was a hero of Rome. Your father was a great general and a popular senator. Too popular, perhaps. The Emperor is a jealous man. A petty man. father lived to serve Rome. Emperor Nero serves only himself. He seeks power for the sake of power. He believes himself a god. A cold wind from the north whispered poisonous words in the Emperor's ear. Your father and other like-minded men wanted to return Rome to its people. So the Emperor had them murdered. After all, that is what Emperors do. The spoils of his greed were divided between his sons, Basilius and Commodus. He lavished upon them great powers and responsibilities for which they were unworthy. Rome is failing its children, Marius. You are a vital piece in the game of man. And you, like all of us, have a role to play. Damocles, spirit of vengeance. The fate of the Empire is in your hands. Save Rome. Save Rome from them.
tiny did entry to the Emperor's tournament. This could be granted by just one man, so I paid him a visit. Damocles? I come for the tournament. Ah! <laughs> You're a gladiator. <laughs> oh. Mm, the, uh, the mythical armor is it's a fine touch indeed. You gave me quite the shot. Only the most skilled fighters can enter the tournament. Let me see if you fight as well as you dress. Brother Commodus may have a contender here. Bravo! <laughs> this just keeps getting better. <laughs> Bring on the next act! A champion of the arena. All the way from the table. Eustinius! Watch yourself. This one is serious. <laughs> My quarters. You want to fight for your emperor, and you shall.
Hmm. Here is your scroll of entry. Don't lose it. You've transformed killing into an art form. I, however, express myself in different ways. Hmm. Here is some of my more recent work. I've just completed the final <clears throat> embellishments. It's a gift for my father, the Emperor. It's an amazing piece of work, if I may say so myself. Containing a, a hidden surprise. A small compartment inside the head that will make it cry the finest white wine to symbolize his great love for the Empire. But I suppose it could be made to cry anything, really. Anything. Blood. Grey mountains drag down the Senate. The street. The streets of Rome will run red. Red with blood. I've seen you in my dreams. Cut me loose if you wish to know your future. Fallen hero of Rome, spirit of vengeance. slain by the great General Marius. And that general shall be slain by Damocles. But Emperor Nero, he can only die by his own sword. You cannot kill him. Commodus was next. Here at the Colosseum, he would show all Rome his great victories and claim our deeds as his own. Now I would earn the right to fight him and cut this poison from the heart of Rome. I would have my vengeance. Can't wait to get out there and fight. You don't have a clue. You'll be slaughtered in the first wave. I've fought in every arena. No man's put me down yet. This is the Colosseum. You aren't meant to fight. You are meant to die.
swiftly like a wolf! The Flanders has a British plan to cow great General Commodus! his head! A thousand denarius to whoever brings it to me! That reward's mine! Sorry, Damocles. It's a thousand denarii. I'll make it quick. Look at you! Vengeful Damocles! Emulating the feats of the great General Commodus! What nonsense! I destroyed the Britons single-handed! You struggle even with all this help! Bad gladiator! Oh, don't forget the real star of the show. Me! Not some stupid gladiator! Me! Oh, come on, Damocles! You're supposed to be emulating my great achievements! How dare you belittle me in front of my adoring minions!
against every nation that dared stand against us. I am the greatest general ever to lead Rome and her people. Today, you have had the honor. Yes, the honor of witnessing the slaughter of every gladiator sent in against me. These once great and feared gladiators now lie dead, broken before you, slain by me, your general, your leader, your savior. Aquilo, I must confess I'm more than a little worried. Why so, my Emperor? My uh, Damocles has been fighting like a lion all day. He still looks alarmingly strong. Fear not for your son's life, my Emperor. I fear not for that little shit's life, you fool. I fear for my purse. I've waited a fortune on him to win. I will shorten the odds. Your purse is safe. Oh. And so is the little... shit. My your general! Your savior! Your god! Say you are protecting Rome. Who will protect you from me? Damocles, take your vengeance. Over here! I'm Commodus, no. you fool! I'm Commodus! I'm Commodus! The show's over for you, Damocles! Which one of these prodigious warriors is the true Commodus? Is it him? Try again! Uh. 
Poison. Can't take any chances, Damocles. You understand. I know I'm immortal, but the plebs can be so fickle. One lucky blow from you and my reputation. Take your last breath, Commodus. I've only ever known one man who can fight like that. Let us finish what your father started, Marius. Quickly, we need to get out of here. Senate is nothing but frightened old men. They no longer listen to truth nor reason. I warned them about Britannia, but to no avail. Commodus has held the legions back, doing nothing, whilst the massive barbarian army has swarmed across the empire, wreaking havoc as it closes in on Rome. The Britons. Yes. And their army has grown tenfold. Everyone who opposes Rome has allied with them. Even 
tribes from faraway lands have sent them massive beasts of war. The Emperor and commoners have made enemies. So many enemies. And across the Empire, these barbarians have seen how weakened we have become under Nero's rule. And they mean to destroy us. Destroy the Empire. With Commodus gone, they'll ask me to assume command. And I'll need my best men if we're going to hold Rome. When I suspected it was you in the arena, I readied this. The Emperor must die. And he will. But we must save Rome first. I need you now, Marius. Fight for your father. Fight for your legion. Fight for Rome. <laughs>